Rainbow families. For Rock this week, we're going to be doing some red ball conditioning. So you can get any kind of ball you have at home that you can hold with two hands, all right? So first, we're going to jump up as high as we can holding our ball and then bend down, touch the ground. And we're going to try and do that five times, seeing how high we can jump without dropping our ball. Then we're going to hold our ball out in front and lift our knees up nice and high, touching our knee to the ball one at a time. Don't let your ball move while you're doing it. Try and do that five times. Then we're gonna try and twist with our ball. So hold your arms out straight and twist your ball side to side. You can track it with your eyes or you can keep your head still and let the ball twist all the way to the side. And then our last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put the ball on the ground and we're gonna try and tap our toe one at a time to the ball, keeping our eyes on the ball, trying not to let it move. Try that five times. Hi, Rainbow students. Today we're going to start with our preschool stretches. So first you're going to make your legs straight out in front and reach way up high, way up high. Then you're going to close your pike and reach for your toes. See how far you can get those fingers out. Then arms up, tuck your knees into your belly, show me your tuck. And then big straddle, super duper straight legs, as big as you can. Then we're going to reach our hands all the way down to one foot. If you've got a scarf or a stuffed animal or something, you can put that down on your toe. Then you're going to reach up. And then you can walk your fingers up to the other side, try and touch that toe, keeping those legs super duper straight in your straddle. Then reach out, fingers out. How far can you walk them? Oh, can anyone touch their nose on the ground? I can't. And then let's shake our legs out. Shake, 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 and freeze. Then tuck your knees, take your hands, put them behind you, and push your belly up. Show me your table. How high can you get your belly up? Super duper high, hold that high knee up. Then come on down, give your knees a big hug, and let's see who can rock and roll. Don't let go of those knees, rock all the way back. And up one more time, rock and roll. And let's glue our feet together, make your butterfly. Flap those wings, flap, flap, flap where you're flying to. And then we can rock our boat side to side, side to side. And get your belly down on your toes. Oh, can anyone do it? Oh, I'm so close, not quite. Right, then we're gonna lay our belly down on the ground. I have a star under me. If you don't have anything, that's okay. Lay your belly down, hands on the floor. Your feet are squeezed together and back. And push up strong arms into your cobra. You wanna keep your hips close to the floor. Keep those feet squeezed together and your fingers are facing me. Then you're gonna push back, knees in your belly, long arms in front, kitty cat stretch. Stretch those arms, keep them nice and straight. Very good. Then we're gonna go way up high on our knees. We're gonna tap one knee and we're gonna say bye bye stinky knee go away you bother me push it way back behind you make it nice and straight keep those hands on the floor in front of you then we're gonna bring it back and do our other knee bye bye stinky knee go away you bother me and push it way and back doing the other leg nice and straight and then bring it back hi rainbow families Instead of the skill of the day, we're going to be reviewing all of the skills we've learned so far. So for our mats, we have our beach tower yoga mat, of course. If you've got your cheese mat, you can use that. We also have our folded up panel mat, or we've got our couch cushion, and then we've got our hula hoop for some fun. All right, so our first skill we're going to do is our log roll. We're showing that on our beach towel. We're going to lay on our back, make our legs super straight, arms up, and you're going to roll, try and stay nice and straight, and you can do that on any of these three mats or just on the floor. On our cheese mat, we're gonna show our forward roll. No matter where you do it, you start feet together, hands up, hands down, look at your belly, roll and reach for the sky. Try not to use your hands to stand up. On our panel mat, we're gonna practice our straddle roll. So you start standing on the mat in a straddle. You put your hands down in the middle, roll and keep your legs in a big straddle and push in the middle to stand up. You can do this on any of these mats as well. Over here on our cushion, we're gonna try our backward roll. All right, so we sit on our bottom, we make our pizza hands lay down and lift our toes over our head on the mat, okay? And then over here on our hula hoop, we're gonna try our cartwheel. So remember, we've got our bunny hop cartwheel, or we can stand in a lunge, okay? Miss Caitlin's gonna show up from a lunge. Hands in the hoop, kick one leg over at a time, and finish on your feet, arms up by your ears. We're gonna shake, shake, shake our feelings out, shake, shake, shake our feelings out, shake, shake, shake our feelings out, wiggle our waggles away. We're gonna clap, clap, clap our crazies out, clap, clap, clap our crazies out, clap, clap, clap our crazies out, wiggle our waggles away. We're gonna. 
I can clap my hands. I can clap my hands. 